Hi, my name is Ankur Jain. Uh, in this quick video, we are going to demonstrate how to install QTP 11.5 on your machine. QTP uh, actually has been renamed to UFT 11.5 now. So you will get this zip file uh, once you have downloaded uh, UFT 11.5 on your machine. This zip file is around 1.71 GB in size. Now you can use any of the unzipping softwares to extract the contents. I personally use a software called 7-zip. Once you have extracted the contents, just go inside that folder and hit setup.exe. Under setup.exe, you need to click on Unified Functional Testing Setup. It will prompt you with various prerequisites that it require. So these are the following prerequisites that you, that you should have installed on your machine. You can simply hit OK and uh, these prerequisites will automatically be downloaded on your machine. Now you can simply click on next to continue with the installation. HPUFT will be installed at its uh, default location. Once QDB is installed, you will get this additional installation requirements screen. You can uh, you can keep all these checked and just uncheck the last one that is run license installation wizard because I assume you, you won't be having the license for QDB since we will be installing the trial version of uh, QDB. The additional components are now being installed. So as can be seen, a new icon is now available on our screen. We will now double click on this icon to start HPUFT. Since this is a trial version, the software license and use will be expired in 30 days. You can, uh, you'll get two buttons here: install license and continue. You should not, you should not click on install license button. Rather, you should click on continue button. You can select all the three add-ins. Hit OK. So we have successfully installed HP UFT on our machines. Thank you.